Joining us today to discuss a special new Israeli film called Tikva is the composer, Dr. Baruch Berliner. And before we start our interview, we'd like to take a quick look at the trailer. Thank you so much for coming in. It's my pleasure. Thank so, you for inviting me. So what I would love to hear from you is just a little bit about this film. How did you guys come up with the idea for the film? I had the idea to integrate somehow a biblical text, text into music and uh, to instill like this uh, the text into people. Uh, I hope uh, also that I'll get with the Symphorok that was uh, written on Genesis uh, to the hearts of the youth in, in all schools in Israel. So you went on a very special trip to Ukraine, correct? Yes. And that's how this film came about, this special Israeli delegation in Ukraine. Tell us a little, about, a little bit about that trip. We came to Ukraine to participate in a special event in commemoration of 75 years of Babi Yar. This was a horrible massacre uh, very early in the Second World War in September 1941. Now uh, the Ukrainian uh, government and the people are much more friendly to Israel and they also uh, give a lot of attention uh, to that event which they did not in the 50s, 60s until uh, the great Russian writer, poet Yevtushenko has written a poem on it and it could not be hidden anymore. I had the honor that the Ukrainian a national symphony orchestra was playing two of my pieces and uh, the national choir, very famous and good choir, Dumka, were singing um, uh, the, their parts in the symphony on Abram in Hebrew. Beautiful. And without any accent. It was unbelievable. It must have been such a special experience for you to be able to travel to this country uh, where that type of respect for the Jewish people just didn't exist once. And so, I, I mean, I understand that you said this earlier, you have a long history of composing verses from the Bible. And what is your inspiration for that? My inspiration is to spread the Bible via music. And the music I try to make uh, very melodious. And uh, actually, I had successes. It was played, two, uh, my two first symphonies were played all over the world, uh, in, several times in California, in a festival in Poland, now in Bulgaria, wow. and of course in Kiev, and many times in Israel by different orchestras. And little do people know it has such a historical connection. Well, thank you so much for joining us and tell us, telling us about this incredible film and about the history to your music, and I hope to watch the film myself. Thank you.